Hey guys, how's it going? It's Jewel Tolentino here. All right, so in this video, I'm gonna show you guys how to save, render, and publish your video. All right, so I've got some test footage here, and first thing is to save your video. Now, there's a couple of different ways to do this. You can go Control S, and that's what I do while I'm editing, just in case something happens with my computer or laptop, if something crashes and it's happened before, where I haven't saved my video and then it crashes, and then sometimes it will have like an auto-saved version, but it might not have everything saved up until the point of it crashing. So make sure that you always hit Control S on your keyboard while you're editing. Another way is to go to File, click save. If you go to file save, it's going to save it under your current title. But if you're like, oh, I want another version of this, but I want to save it differently, like under a different name, you would go to save as, and then you would change the name and it would create another version of this Camtasia working file. So you'd have two of these, one with the previous name and one with the new name. And it would have the same files. So it's a way of duplicating as well if you wanted another version. For instance, I do that sometimes if I'm wanting to take some footage from the previous video and then add it to another video with some new stuff. So you can either go Control S, File, Save, or File, Save As if you're wanting to change the title. Next, to render your video and publish your video. So rendering is that thing that you see with the percentages and it's making it your finalized video. Saving it here will not make your video uh, into an MP4 format that you can upload onto, let's say, YouTube or onto your website. You need to render it and publish it. So how you do that is you click on Share click on local file and from here I go to mp4 only up to 720 or mp4 only up to 1080 depending on you know what kind of version you want but I typically go for 720 and for Arit's music videos I'll go 1080 because I want it to be like full but better quality so from here you would click that then you would click next and then your production name. So what do you want this video to save as? So I'll put test video and then you can choose the folder that it goes in. So right now I have it set to the desktop. If you click this, you can change it and have it go somewhere else. I like it to go on the desktop and then here post production options you can show the post uh, production results which I don't really care too much about and then play the video after the production so after that you click finish and then it's gonna do something like this so it's gonna say rendering your project so when that hits to a hundred it's going to do a couple of things so it just finished here and this is the test video and it popped up on the screen and it's going to automatically play. If you don't want it to automatically play then you can uncheck that option. I'm going to click exit out of this and then you can click open production folder and then your video is going to show up there. And then from here, this is on my desktop right now, so you can upload this onto YouTube, you can upload it to a website, whatever you want to do with it. So that is how you save, render, and publish your videos. So if I was able to help you out at all, please let me know by giving this video a like, a comment, or subscribe. All that would be very much appreciated. And if you want more Camtasia tutorials, head down to the description below as I have a bunch more free tutorials for you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Back from the dead.